Oh man, check it out. Oh, the smell right now would burn your eyes out. I gotta tell you about what's washing up this week. Okay, so let me pick the camera up so you can kind of see better what we're looking at here. Um, we figured out that these things are actually from a family of mollusks called Teriidae. And it's uh, spelled a little odd, so I'll put it up on the camera there. But uh, these are like feathered oysters. Uh, what you would see in there is like pearl oysters. Uh, but these are juveniles, so they're kind of hard to tell the species. But man, there is just so many of them. It's, it's wild to see this many in one spot. Actually, I've never seen this before. Uh, but you know, most of these uh, oysters are filter feeders. So they're feeding on like microorganisms, you know, things that are floating around in the water. And uh, man, these are so thick on the beach right here that I'm walking through them. And whenever I get done walking through them, man, they're all over my toes and everything. It's like some of these areas is probably like six inches thick. I'm just kind of sinking into them. When I pick them up, they're real thin. So you could actually, if you wanted to, you could easily just crush them between your fingernails. They're, they're so thin, kind of fragile. Um, you know, unfortunately, we probably don't know a lot about this particular species of mollusk. Um, and, and that's not uncommon for things that we find in the ocean that uh, when stuff like this happens, you know, we there's we can kind of guess at why so many of them have washed up here today but uh, my guess would probably be you know it's been real hot we've had low uh, surf like the waves have been small so uh, probably low dissolved oxygen and the heat might have gotten to them um, you know I have seen you know kind of what might be beneficial uh, for something like this happening is you know it's bad that all these are washing up maybe but you know there's birds feeding on them so you know there is you know this cycle of the food chain the food web you know things uh, get washed up things get eaten and then it's kind of like the biological process we're seeing right in front of our eyes here uh, I did see that these have washed up about a quarter mile of the beach right here uh, next to the jetty is the thickest part for sure and it's probably about a hundred feet in, in length but it does go for about a quarter mile where you still see these uh, little oysters washing in okay so now you know everything there is to know about this uh, first time I've ever seen it but now you can go tell everybody that you know what's washing up talk to you later bye